faith is a journey. It's, it's, but it's a process and it draws you closer to your creator. We got married in 2012, June of 2012. The Lord has been the center of our relationship and we, we have trusted him for everything. Our car, the life we have, the furniture in our house, everything. But there was this little area that was, will we ever have a child? There are times when I, 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 I lost hope. Yeah. Uh, the hope of uh, becoming a father. I remember, you know, sometimes Shirley would come to me with proposed names of the child. As a matter of fact, Shirley believed God for, to provide us with, to give us twins. Through that time, um, the Lord again confirmed to us that we were meant to be together because He just kept giving us that peace. Uh, it wasn't easy all the time. It's right. easier talking about it now. But the Lord always told us to trust Him. Yes. And um, that it will happen in His time. I would uh, remind the Lord of what He did. Isaac called on the, on the Lord to open the womb of Rebecca and the Lord did it. It was um, 2017 and one morning I woke up and it was an especially hard morning yeah. and many women would understand this because you know that God's given you a promise but when's it going to happen? You know, and that's a question on all of our minds when God gives you a word, a promise, you know. You just kind of wake up and you're like, oh, this is never going to happen. You don't know why, but it's just this, this thing. And I, I went to my phone and I, I, I'd received an email from Auntie Marilyn. And she said, Shirley, I was at color and I stood on your behalf and prayed for you. One of our other friends said to us, you know, we want to do whatever it takes to help you guys, to help you guys conceive, if it's assisted pregnancy or whatever it may be. But for us, that's, that's not what God had. Yeah. You know, God wanted us to wait and He wanted us to be obedient and wait. And I remember like when Calvin and I would pray together, we would say, Lord, one day we will testify of your goodness. Yes, absolutely, yes. One day. Yeah. It was a year to the day, to this, this week, that we found out we were pregnant with Sela. It had been such a long wait that you honestly don't even know how to react. You're just like, what? Okay. But to hold this little girl in our arms and she's active and jumping and doing all of this, it's like, God, you're so faithful. That's right. You know. It's trusting in the Lord. It is depending on God to, um, to see me through in difficult times and challenging times or to provide what I need grant me the desires of my heart. Give me faith to trust what you say that you're